Hi, I'm Bob Boros, and this is my Jazz and Tap Dance Life. This is my YouTube video channel where I discuss and practice everything to do with jazz and tap dancing. Uh, right now we're working on a tap dance series, so we're going to be bringing you a new step. This is called a round cramp roll. Now, most of us know what a cramp roll is. It's a very basic step. Usually you step on the right, you step on the left, you drop the right, you drop the left. So it's a zigzag pattern, right, left, right, left. But in this one, we're going to change it up. It's going to be in a circular pattern. So I would go right, left, left, right, or I would go left, right, right, left as I do the cramp roll section. And we do it in a side to side fashion. So it's got a little tricky footwork, a little turn in and turn out from the thigh. And it's a great step to use, particularly if you want to do a soft shoe, you could put it in there because it's got a nice triplet rhythm, one and a two, three and a four, okay? So this is the round cramp roll. Okay, so if we begin our round cramp roll, as I said, it was a side-to-side -side action, and it's a circular pattern. So I'm going to put my right foot out to the side. I'm going to lift the toe up. The first begins with a full lap coming in underneath, but as I do that, I pick the other foot out, and it's going to go out. So it's like one foot knocking the other foot out to make that work. Six, seven, eight. Right? And I'm turned in on this foot out to the side because it's going to rock and turn out. Six, seven, eight. All right. Notice how I'm lifting up and then settling down. Now, as I do this, I'm going to drop the outside heel first and begin to turn out from the hip. Then I drop the inside heel after. Okay. Outside heel, inside heel. So that's a very simply what it is. Fall lap, step, outside heel, inside heel to make the round cramp roll. Six, seven, eight. Notice as I do this, my weight stays centered. I am not moving my body side to side. Only my legs are moving side to side. All right, to make the round cramp roll. Six, seven, eight. If I want to come back, I start with the full lap inward. Take the step out to the side, drop the outside heel first, and then the inside heel from there. So I would have fall lap, step, outside heel, inside heel, with the rock and turn. Six, seven, eight. Right? Six, seven, eight. Easy. Now this is something we can just do consecutively just to keep it going. Six, seven, eight. And it has a nice look because of the turn in and the turn out. So you want to accentuate that as much as possible. You don't want to step down in a parallel fashion. You want to rock it out. Six, seven, eight. And that's our round cramp roll. Now, if I want to, I can have a little toe over with a weight shift where I could link two round cramp rolls together. So I'm going to pull to the side a little bit. So from here, I begin my regular round cramp roll. But from here, I'm going to shift the toe and bring my weight with it. So I'm walking over on the heel to the toe with a little toe drop. From there, I complete one regular round cramp roll. Okay, so that way I link two together. Six, seven, eight. A one and a two and a three and a four. Five, six, seven, eight. If I want to come back, I begin with the outside leg. There's the walk over with my weight shift of the body. You got to bring your body over that toe and finish with a regular, right? Six, seven, eight. So that gives a nice stream of a triplet rhythm, a one and a two and a three and a four, a five and a six and a seven and eight. Five, six, seven, eight. All right, and that's your round cramp roll with a little weight change. Five, six, seven, eight. Now sometimes what I've done is link Continue that step over so you can continue going in the same direction. You can go as long as you want. A one and a two and a three and a four and a five and a six and then finish it off and then bring it all the way back. We don't have the room for that here. So this is our round cramp roll and we add a little flip over the toe so that we can link two together. Six, seven, eight.
And that's a nice step. Like I said, it works really well with soft shoes and just about anything else that requires a nice loose fluidity in the movement. Okay, so round cramp roll is something new. My name is Bob Boros. This is my jazz and tap dance life. Thanks for watching. Uh, please subscribe to the channel. Click the notification bell. Click the like button because that tells YouTube it's good information and they're more likely to put it out there in the rotation for other people to see. So thanks for watching and I'll be back soon with another tap dance video.